Hey guys, it's Nikki and uh sorry but I'm kind of pissed off pissed off because this microphone is not working properly and I am going to freak out if it's not working this time again. Okay. Um so yes, I've decided to do a book review or report, whatever you want to call it, and well I've got a book with me today and or tonight depends on where you live <laughs> okay and uh, um, yeah it's this book and um, it's called The Remarkable Life and Times of Eliza Rose and um, yeah it's written by Mary Hooper okay and well i'm just going to read out what it says you know on the back because uh yeah i'm not very original and i'm not good with summaries so yes here goes uh london 1670 15 year old eliza rose is thrown into cling prison for stealing a pasty she is rescued by a brash grubby woman known as old margwin but her relief soon turns to horror when she realizes the kind of life a new benefactress has in mind for her Eliza has come to the city to search for her beloved father and a place to call home, but fate seems to be conspiring against her. From orange cellar to highwayman's mall to lady's maid, Eliza will take on many remarkable guises, but will she ever find out what she, yearn what she yearns to know, just where it is she truly belongs? So yes, I really like this book, um, and I think fellow Gemma Doyle fans are going to like it as well because it's really gripping and it's said well about 200 years before the Gemma Doyle series actually takes place or supposed to take place and well yeah but you know it's all you know corsets and you know the, it was all kind of similar so yes i think that's a really great thing about this book that it kind of shows you how life was back then and uh yes um sorry i'm kind of tired right now and as you can see, it's dark outside, and I'm just really, really tired. And uh, um, so yes, I really like this book. And if you like stuff that has corsets and actresses and fun and sadness in it, then and mystery and secrets and twists and cool things then um i think you will actually like this book so um yeah i can just really recommend it to anyone so yes thanks for watching for enduring this little rumble of mine and um yes please subscribe us 